just replaced three of the OG starter pets with different and brand new shadow pets. It's pretty strange. Now you may know that I, these at the bottom were looked shadowish. This guy, they looked like more like Astral, right? And the evolution went from this guy to to this guy, and then finally to this guy. However, now it's changed, and the order of the pet book is kind of being disrupted because now you can see that this pet and this pet and then this pet they have a final evolution, and this is not connected with them anymore. It is completely it's a separate pet now, and. This pet right here has an evolution, and I'm going to be doing that. I want to do it, okay? So, that's what I'm doing. I'm going to go to the last page. You can see that it's right here, correct? So, yeah. Let's do it. Let's figure it out. And what is this pet going to be? I have no idea, but I'm really curious to see what they look like, because they do look pretty cool. And uh, so far for this one... These ones that, it, uh, that we've seen, they look pretty sick, okay? So, yeah, we'll look at how cool that looks. This pet, they're not the best. They are pretty good, though. They're not that, that bad. So, yeah, we're going to be spending 130 magic points. I completely forgot it existed. Magic points existed, but we're going to have to do it for the sake of the video. And look at this, and boom. Look at that animation, it just looks sick. And now we can see that there's a big difference here. And they're bad, okay? I didn't notice, I didn't know that they would become this bad. And this is a pretty bad pet. You know, actually, no, you know, Shadow Storm's really good. Barrage is pretty good. It's okay. And Dirt Globe. You know, no reliable spell, okay? But otherwise, it's it's decent. It's decent. It's a decent pet. Pretty okay, you know. So I can't can't scream, you know. It's not. It's it's bad, but it's not like horrendous, you know. There are pets that are much much worse, but I definitely love the look. It just looks so cool, so cool, so cool. Yeah, but these spells, I don't know. So let's go ahead and test them out into battle. Ooh, we can collect boom, boom, and boom. Oh, we have one more. can get this. Then we can go to Skywatch which we will test out against a random battle. So let's go ahead and see if this pet is good. I'm not going to test them out in the dual state because I have no idea what to really combo them with. So let's test them out into battle. Let's see how they're going to do. I'm pretty curious to see how these, this pet is going to do. Okay, first up, I am going. Oh, i got to make a thing on my... Okay, let's do you first, Hob. I'm gonna use okay, one shot. Um, I do okay. This pet looks really good. I'm not gonna lie, they look so cool. Definitely one of my sh favorite shadow pets. There's a ton of new shadow pets being added, which is great. Um, I guess we can see how much damage Dark Globe is gonna do. Five fifty. Okay, that does more than sever. Okay, that did way more than sever. So that's pretty, pretty good, okay? I'm not going to lie. That's a pretty good spell, okay? So we may have a good Shadow Pet here, y'all. We might have a good Shadow Pet here. Let's see how much Shadow Storm is going to do. Might miss one of them. Okay, it missed one of them, but it does 185 if it makes one of them. Which, for 185 times 2 is 370. Or no, wait. Yeah, 370, yeah. Um, each, that is very good. That is really good. Okay, so if you get lucky and hit all of them twice, you're set. So, okay, it starts on the pink bruiser. 
start on four and add five. Okay, and we can end them up like that. And to compare, flash would do only 195, and that's a singular hit. So we've got a pretty good pet here, y'all. You know, I may have underestimated them a little bit, but they're pretty good. Um, can't lie, can't lie. So yeah, never mind. I guess we do have a pretty good shadow pet here. Um, I do still have to get test out the other pets. Um, I wonder if they're going to become you know available like around the map or something. Because right now, currently, um, the the least evil evolved one we can't even get anymore. The only place we can actually get that we can only get the second most evolved one. And that is in the archives, at least. Probably, because we used to... I mean, it's very confusing on how they've done this. Um, they've made it into a separate pet. I feel like they're not done with the Celestia. The Celestia, they're definitely not finished with. They're probably going to make it into Astral. I'm not going to lie to you guys. I'm saying this here and now. This pet is going to become Astral. Trust. I don't know why it's water. It, it's going to become... It's going to be... It has to become Astral. So, yeah, um, yeah, that's my prediction. It's most likely to be gonna, be gonna, it's most likely gonna become Astral. As I just do this quick archive, run, get that, and let's go down here. Yeah, so comment down below right now, pause the video, and comment down below what you think about this new pet. It's... It's interesting, you know, it's it's a pretty good pet, and honestly, it's better than the other pets were, because no one really used that other pet. But yeah, so, let's go here. No battles. Okay, the, the, there's a squat way. What about here? Really? Okay, keeper. Yeah, so nothing, nothing really crazy. But yeah. It's interesting. It's an interesting pet. Comment down below. And like if you guys enjoyed the video. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.